What's going on, guys? Pegasus from the Wise Guys. I don't know why it zoomed in on you, bro. Well, I'm here with Armin Memedovic. Shout out to the Wise Guys. Shout out to the Wise Guys. YG. YG. <laughs> Painting all the way around, going the reverse way. But we're here with Armin Memedovic, the Mech Knight Captain. That's the actual captain over there. But, you know, this is the Mech Knight Captain over here. Shout out to him. Got top four today with Mech Knight. And we're, uh, we're just going to jump straight into it. Yeah, you're good, bro. So we got three. Uh, Gersu. Uh, Gersu is the starter in this deck to dump uh, this guy. This is mainly what he goes for. And obviously with the world armor stuff, um, you're getting to target a face-up monster your opponent, special summon from their extra, and then, like, return, basically. But he's just setting it up for um, a lot of the world legacy shenanigans that he can go for. We'll get to in a second. Shout out to Purple Nightfall, the, the overall searcher. Then Blue Sky is the second searcher. And then obviously, you got the rest of the Mech Knights. The reason why he's playing this one is for the FTK. Um, we talked about this a lot during uh, the week because he has been requested in Germany like 100 times. Go off a of Link Spider play. But uh, the World Legacy Scars stuff, which we'll get to in a second, is the FTK. Is why he's playing this one. And then this one is Spell and Trap. So basically, Spell and Trap monster and then a uh, slidey boy you know for the for those that don't know how to slide on them but, but cap captain knows how to slide you know slide, the <laughs> slide. slide to the right to the back two times all right ibli so you got three ibli so when you go first to lock out mm. yeah Going first for the obvious lockout. And then there, there's some other shenanigans he's going to show off in a, in a split second. But just in case the FDK misses, he's still trying to ibli you. Processor, the card that is the reason why we are doing this. So obviously, with Processor, it says you can banish this card you control, special summon up to two machines, psychics, and or cyburst monsters from your hand. I don't need to say a whole lot more. You can see what you can see. It allows you to extend, and this is more copies of these, and then gets the special summon any of these. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Thank you, Konami. Thank you for being so silly. Goodness. Alrighty. Shout out to the Mech Knight uh, Yu-Gi-Oh Day mat, too, by the way. Very classic. Classic mat. Three, na three Ash. I mean, three Nib. Listen to me. Three Droll. Good. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. World Legacy Scars. Now, why? Why? So, so, yeah. So, for the FDK, seven names. Isn't it seven names? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Names. You can banish eight, eight monsters with different names from your grave and or face up from your field. Send your opponent's entire hand and extra deck to the graveyard. Mm -hmm. How many times? Just one? Twice? Mm -hmm. Probably on average. My bad. I had like zoomed all the way in on this guy's uh, face. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Armin, man. Um, but he probably pulled it off twice today that I saw in locals, which that, that happens a lot. And then, yes, he does play this in regionals as well. But, you know, he, he changes it up a little bit for obvious reasons. Big events. Obviously, you got World Legacy Key to be able to pull cards back. And then this negates opponent's trap effects, just in case they don't remember. That activates in the same column as a Mech Knight monster you control. Very, very interesting. Then you got two World Legacy Succession. Obviously, special summon to a zone of Link Monster points, too. You got three World Legacy's Memory. You got three E emergency teleport. Shout out to the ultis. You know, these may disappear before they make the profile. You know, these may you may not ever see them again. You know, you know, wise guys text. But very, very broken, 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 extremely broken. Yeah. Trust me, trust me. I saw it pop off twice today, and I saw what he was doing. So hey, I don't even want to know anymore. You got two 
world legacy secrets obviously anything in that column it gets negated and then evenly matched to evenly match out the game when you're going second always go second doesn't matter so i've watched mech mech knights played by armin he doesn't really care if you make him go first he's still going to put up a pretty serviceable board so that kind of is what it is got uh some naruto cards and you know a trick star tokens i don't know what no. <laughs> <laughs> kind of game are you playing over here? You got one Link Spider to go with the Avril. You got one Al Mirage to also get that Ibley off his side of the field and then be able to get out of the way, obviously, if he needs to, and not just Link Karibo. Could play Link Karibo, I guess. Oh, he is playing Link Karibo. See? Always, always. Just so. so last time, I think I, last time I did this list, he, he wasn't, but this time he was. So processor, banish, special. Make link Karibo. Mm -hmm. Give it to them. Now usually he get this out. If he can't get this out of the way, he won't go into this. Obviously, you go into Almirage, you got other cards, and then he can't run the Ibley into you can't run your Ibley that he gave you into him. If that makes any sense. All right. We got uh, Borcade board blocker to be able to pitch a card out of your hand. I guess another name. And to search out World Legacy's key, the card that you already see that again says negate in the, any opponent's trap effect that activates in the same column. That's actually a really, really nice touch. Make sure you read your cards. That's Barricade Board Blocker. And obviously you got the trap to be able to line up as well. That's broken. Being able to grab either one. You got liner for light targets for the Mech Knights. You got three. Three of them things. Three of them things, bro. Three, three of them, them things. things. Three of them things. All right. Three of them things, bro. <laughs> three of them things. Blade three Masters. Things. Three of them things, bro. Just being able to link off uh, with with Blade Master, be able to bounce stuff out of the mm -hmm. way that doesn't mm -hmm. doesn't target. I don't think it does. <laughs> I can check that out. And then obviously you got Morning Star. To be able to um, piss your opponent off because they don't want to read the card and they just want to run into it and they can't because you got to like read the card and not line up in front of them and you know it's like Ray Lewis or something. Can't destroy them if they're in the same column, right? Or unless they're in the same column, but negate their effects if they're in the same column. It's just bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, World Legacy Key and this guy, Spectrum Supreme. That's the guy that's in the background on the mat, just in case you didn't notice that. But again, Spectrum Supreme. This card can attack directly. Let you guys read that. If this card is in the extra monster zone and no pot, it's not pointing to anything. It says it cannot be destroyed by card effects. Just in case y'all didn't remember. And if you don't know, now you know. Got Abramax. Mm -hmm. I got you. Yep. Double Ava Mac. Two. Mm -hmm. Always. Always. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So basically to play every single time, go into your Gersu shenanigans, get into get into her, get into Ava Max. World Legacy scars them. If you can't, then you sit on the Ava Max until they die. Basically. I think he ended up going X1 today. So, I mean, this deck is pretty strong, and he's always going undefeated to locals with it or doing well in regionals and all kind of stuff with it. So, shout out to Armin. And then the Unicorn, obviously. Double spin, because there's one here, one spin, two spins. Right. Dumb. Just in case, you know, you know, he he be he be hiding the side deck. I wouldn't go. I was gonna let him. All right, Bistules. Got triple Druid's worm. So basically, more board breaking that all works in synergy <clears throat> together. I was kind of letting him get that off a little bit, but. In tandem, all of these together, triple spins, basically. Really, really good. Really, really key at breaking boards. And in playing Mech Knights, it's perfect to go along with it. I got you.
Got triple gamma seal. Uh, Inspector Kaiju over here, you know, Captain Kaiju over here. What do you think about the Kaijus in the in the board over there? You know, oh, it's a good Kaiju. It's a good Kaiju. It's a good Kaiju. Lapras. Shout out to Lapras. Line them basically Kaiju over the top of them. Make them line up in the same column as the Mech Knight and kill them. Spooky dogwood for time. You know, you know, Dame time. Arm in time. We call it arm in time around here, you know. <laughs> Are you going to try to FTK me? No, you ain't. Yeah, you're going to FTK yourself. And especially all these decks are like the special right now. This is really, really interesting mm -hmm. tech right now. A Romage profile coming soon. Remember I said that. Triple Cyclone. I think this is the best card in the in the game right now. Like, weirdly, best card. Like, really, really insane card right now. Blows Fire King out of the water. Or at least makes them start to make moves that they have to do and it's really really key and then summon limit because he's a jerk hey man um <laughs> appreciate you for the profile bro remember armin memedovich make sure you check him out he will be on the page more and more cosmo profile coming soon from the wise guys shout out to the homies captain oh gee triple Quadruple. Make sure you oh, get it right. Got four now? <laughs>